Good morning and welcome to week 9 of Phase 3 Phonics. Today we're going to be revising reading the letter names and we're also going to be looking at teaching and writing two syllable words. So get your whiteboards, whiteboard pens, pens and paper ready and when you're ready we'll get started. OK, so we're going to have a go at reading the capital letters and using their letter names. OK, so what's this first letter? That's right, that's the E. Next letter. That's right, that's a J. It can also have a cross across there. Next letter. A. Next letter. U. Next letter F. H. C. M, G, W, B, T, S, I, K, N, X, O, Z, L, P, Q, D, V, R, Y, and that's it. Okay, so today we're going to have a go at reading the two-syllable words. And again, they're coloured to help you. So I want you to go, I'm going to read the first one just to remind you how to do it. And then you can have a go on your own. So, D, E, P, Deep, Er. Uh. So let's do it together. D, E, P. Deep, uh, brilliant. You have a go at this one now. So f, e, o, feel, uhs, uhs, feelers. Next one. So w, a, t, wait, uh. Waiter. And then our last one. So, m, a, n, main, ps, a, o, sale. Brilliant. Okay, so we're going to have a go at copying those now. So, first word you're going to do is deeper. So that is d e p er. You copy it. When you're ready, start the video again, grown-ups. Next word is feelers. F e o er s. Feelers. Next word is waiter. W a t wait. Uh, digraph. And then last one is mainsail. M a n s a o mainsail. Brilliant work. So now we're going to play what's in the box with some of those words and one new two-syllable word. OK, so as we did last week, you need to read each of the words and then point, show, point to which word you think, which picture matches that word. So I'm going to pause the video now and grown up, start the video again when you're ready to go and see if you agree with what I think. 
Okay, welcome back. So the first word is m a n main a o sail, and main sail I think is there because can you see that's the main sail in red. Let's see if I'm right. And up it goes. Brilliant. Next word, w a t wait er. Uh. Waiter, can you see him? He looks very happy, pleased to take your order. And I think he's over here. Right, now, next word is f e o feel -ers. Feelers. Well, that doesn't look like feelers to me. I think there's feelers on that snail. It's an amazing giant snail, isn't it? Brilliant. And then the last one, which is the new word, is b e s b e s W -a -x, wax. So that looks a bit like wax, and actually it's hexagonal, so we know bees make hexagonal chambers. So I think it must be that. Let's see if we're right. And well done. That was brilliant work. OK. So to finish with today, we've got a sentence to read. So here we go. The p -e -t pet p -a -t had f e -o Feel, uh, feelers, and got the dots there, but let's do it anyway. And, and tricky word was deep, deep, red. So let's read it for fluency, and I bet you can guess what pet they've got. That's right, there it is again. The pet had feelers and was deep red and that is the end of today's phonics lesson, lesson.